goals of UML. So let us discuss more explicitly what are the goals we are going to achieve through this UML. So a picture is worth a thousand words. Obviously, reading one long paragraph or reading one long document or writing a code, thousands of lines of code is very difficult to understand. But one diagram which is representing that documentation and thousands of lines of code will be very easy for us to comprehend, to interpret and to assess. UML supports object oriented concepts. So in case of UML diagrams we are having, we are going to discuss our class diagram, object diagram and they are really based on the object oriented language concepts. UML defines some general purpose modeling language which all modelers can use and it also needs to be made simple to understand and use. So this is having some universal approach. So that's why the UML is has become so much popular. UML diagrams are not only made for developers but also for business users, common people and anybody interested to understand the system. So it is not like that, that email is only for the testers, only for the debuggers, only for the developers, only for the coders, it is not like that. Any people from the management, any common people or any other users, business users who are eager to learn or know about the system can easily use these UML diagrams. The system can be a software or non-software system. It is very important. So we should not make ourselves biased to tell that EML is for the software development only. For any kind of non-software system also, EML diagrams, UML can be applied. UML is not a development method, rather it accompanies with the processes to make it a successful system. So don't think that UML is a development method a development tool, it is not like, not like that. Actually, you are representing your system which you are going to develop with the help of different UML diagrams and with the help of which you can go for visualizing, constructing, documenting, implementing the respective system. So that's why UML is not only for the development method. It is not the development method, rather it accompanies the processes to make it a successful system after implementation. UML is a simple modeling mechanism to model all possible practical systems in today's complex environment. So in, in, in our today's complex environment to represent one system, UML is one of the good choices. So that is the goal of our UML. So in this way, in this video, we have discussed the what is the goal, what are the goals of UML. Thanks for watching this video.